that broke my soul because in my teachings, from my knowledge, from my old people, the first law for everybody even to understand is that when all our people walk on their journey and all those old, all those, all those different tribes from all those 400 different nations, they come to a small sacred ceremonial ground. And when they come to that small sacred ceremonial ground, that's where they got all their song and dance. They, all the issues was all sorted out in the one spot. And as they made their journey there, they had great respect for the land. And it was really spiritual for them, you know, all the old people. And to take that away after 60,000 years of still practicing traditional caretaking of, of this great, you know, our great sacred land that we share with the rest of the world, you know, from other, la other people from other lands, that's, that broke my soul, you know. Why would you want to do that? Why would you want to take someone's cultural identity, their connection back to their history? Their history is not written down on paper, but it's a part of it's a part of our blueprint. Who we are as caretakers of from our ancestors, you know, and passed down after generation after generation. I mean, that thing broke my soul, you know. I was crying. Why would you want to do that? And I just couldn't understand, you know. If you can't, if you're going to deny me of my of my birthright, you just broke my law, but. And you're still making me, making my people, like if we're protesting, we're not protesting, we're practicing, practicing a culture that was, practicing our culture that was given to us from thousands and thousands and thousands, thousands and thousands, I can go on and on to say thousands of years, you know, and them practices still taking, taking place today.